Hey there, if you're a woman in your 40s and you woke up overnight and said, what happened to my skin? I suddenly have sagging and wrinkles and what happened? Then this video is for you. In this video, I'm gonna talk about the four ways estrogen is valuable for your skin. I'm Dr. Jennifer Rollins, board certified OBGYN in integrative medicine. And in this video, I wanna talk specifically about how estrogen is so incredibly powerful for your skin. So let's dive in. But before we do that, make sure you like and subscribe this channel because I want to be able to share this information with more people on YouTube. And I need you to like and subscribe and be part of the community. I publish weekly videos on every Saturday. So if you want more information, make sure you also put that bell alert so you'll know. Okay, let's dive in. So most women think about estrogen related to their period and their menstrual cycle. And yes, estrogen is incredibly valuable, right? It's one of the two main hormones that drives menstrual cycles. In fact, in estrogen, you actually see an, a rise in estrogen, say day 10 to 14, that rise causes an LH spike, which causes ovulation. And actually a lot of women will say, my skin is awesome during that time. And then the, the level falls down and you have a little bit of a bump up, but ultimately it goes down, say day 24, 25, 26. And then women will often say, oh my gosh, like I got pimples right before my period. That's how I know my period is gonna happen because I end up uh, having a drop in estrogen and then precipitate all these changes in my skin. Same thing goes when you're pregnant. When you're pregnant, you have so much estrogen on board. In fact, most women say, I have glowy skin, right? People say, you you must be pregnant because your skin is glowing because your skin loves estrogen. So in, like she, in the layers of the skin, estrogen has um, both two types of receptors, so an alpha and a beta receptor. And this is why both estradiol and estriol are both used in beauty products. But let's dive in specifically to how estrogen can be the secret to your aging skin. So number one, estrogen actually helps make collagen. Um, and so when you age, so if you look at a skin of someone who's 25, and then you compare it to someone who's 60, the skin on someone who's 25 looks more plump and luscious, no fine lines and wrinkles. It just looks glowy, right? Because estrogen is actually, if you were to sort of, for lack of a better word, peel back the skin layer, you would notice that 25 year olds have lots of plump fat in their face. They have good bone structure. And so those things, as we age, change. We lose bone structure, right? We lose bone. We lose the fat in the face and we lose that collagen, that plumping appearance. So as you age, estradiol goes down, especially when you're in perimenopause, and then ultimately in menopause, you have no estradiol, or very minimal, I should say, because you can also still make it from other locations besides the ovaries. But you lose then that plumpness, the collagen, the, the, the nice and smooth texture of the skin. And when you give someone back estradiol, like with systemic estrogen, they actually notice their skin looks a little bit more full. Their skin looks more radiant, more fullness. So since collagen drops by about 30% in menopause, then replacing estrogen can be huge. Reason number two, so our skin needs hydration. And when we're younger, we have hyaluronic acid that helps retain moisture in the skin, keeps it from drying out. And estradiol or estrogen also helps make hyaluronic acid. So when you lose estrogen in menopause, you lose that ability of the skin to hold on to moisture. And most women will say, gosh, my skin is so dry. I feel like my makeup just sinks in. I notice this crepiness in my neck because of the lack of hydration. So estrogen is really important, not only for collagen, but also for hyaluronic acid and help retaining moisture. In fact, a lot of beauty products, as you know, have hyaluronic acid in them for a reason, because when you give it the skin hyaluronic acid, it wants to retain moisture. Reason number three, estrogen helps with the thickness of the skin. So when you age, your skin becomes very pale and thin, easy to bruise because estrogen helps with the layers 
not only underneath the collagen and the fat and the bone, but even in the layers of the actual skin. You have different, you have a superficial layer and deeper layers, and it helps with the thickness. So when you're younger and you have lots of estrogen in your 20s and you're cycling very regular, then you'll notice your skin actually is thicker and fuller. And as you age, it becomes more pale and thin and fragile. So it, estrogen is incredibly valuable for that. And, you know, we see this also in men, not just women, that, that men tend to have thinner, paler, and more fragile skin. Because not only the layers underneath that kind of help with the plumpness, but even the layer on top. The last and final reason that estrogen is so incredibly important and also the secret to your anti-aging is that it is anti-inflammatory. It is a magnificent hormone that helps lower inflammation everywhere in your brain and your bones and ultimately also in your skin. So when you have estrogen in your body, then you fight infections much better. You tend to um, actually keep even autoimmune disorders like skin, like eczema. People tend to have less flares when they have really good hormones and working. Like imagine, for example, when you're postpartum, during pregnancy, you have a ton of hormones. And so most people do not get eczema flares. And then they deliver and suddenly their hormones drop drastically and they notice they start getting all these breakouts because their declining estrogen causes them to then have no inflammation and no immune system protection. And that ultimately leads them to have more flares. This is why women develop more autoimmune conditions when they go through menopause because they suddenly lose this powerful anti-inflammatory, antioxidant hormone, and it affects their skin. So all of these being said, four ways that estrogen is the secret to anti-aging, you can use estrogen on your face. In fact, there are a lot of different formulations. There are ones with just estradiol, remember the active hormone, or estradiol and estriol, because remember they're both alpha and beta receptors in the skin. In fact, one of the things I love to use is this skincare regimen that has estradiol, copper peptides, and hyaluronic acid because it helps retain moisture. The copper peptides are great nutrients for the skin. And then the estrol helps fix the skin. So there are a lot of different formulations. If you're interested, I made a video specifically. So the next video you can watch is about estrogen on the skin and the different preparations. Until next time, thanks for joining me.